Hello, welcome back to my channel. This is another quick tutorial. Today we'll be covering how to add a blur, or also known as a blur box, which is meant to hide something for security or identity, privacy, things like that. As always, if you enjoy these helpful videos, please subscribe so you know when I drop new content. Let's begin. So I will open a video file from some dash cam footage from a while ago. Give ourselves some room to work. Let's add a video track. Let's add another video track just because I like to have room to work. Click, hold, and drag down into this area. This is the timeline. This goes a little fast because I have another video which explains how to start using Shotcut for beginners. I'll put that up here in the corner. And I like to keep these tutorials short so we don't take up all of your valuable time. Okay, so we only need a few seconds of... Okay, that'll work right there. So let's cut that part out and let me get about 12 seconds of time and we'll cut that part out, remove that. I don't care about the sound, so we'll mute the audio channels. Okay, let's make this a little big so we can see what we're doing while we work. We're going to need to add some filters. Make sure you have the track selected, filters, and then add. We're going to use mask, simple shape. We're going to use mask apply and we're going to use a blur and here we have a few examples of some blurs let's use the Gaussian because it's easy to use and pretty effective step one go to your Gaussian blur and let's max it out so we can see there it is there's our blur box there's our rectangle it was otherwise invisible so now let's go to the simple shape shape rectangle ellipse changes to oval triangle or diamond let's go back to the ellipse so horizontal and vertical this is the position of that blur so if you slide it over you see that the blur moves vertical position up and down So let's say these individuals right here do not consent to be in the video. We want to blur them out. So let's bring this over. Bring it. Whoop. Some finesse is required. Bring it right there. Now that's way too much blur. So let's go back to the cause and blur. Now let's take it down to zero and slowly bring it up. There. Now they're blurred out. But when we watch the video, it doesn't look too terrible. But you can tell that they're blurred out over there. What if it wasn't the people? What if you wanted to cover your date and time? Let's go to the simple shape. Let's change it to a rectangle. Where is it? It's over there. Let's make it 100% so it's easy to see. Move it over. Move it on top of that. That's way too big and looks way too sloppy. Me personally, I'm going to take it down to where you can see that there's something behind there. There. So now when you play the video, everything's clear, but this is blurred out. All right, and it's just that easy. I hope you found this helpful, and if you have any questions, please hit me up in the comment section below. And again, please subscribe so you know when I drop new videos. Thank you. See you next time.